Hey guys, this is Mike from B-Tech Reviews here, and today is the unboxing and quick overview of the Umidigi U-Series Watch 3. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today is the unboxing of something that I don't normally do, uh, which is wearable tech. It is a Umidigi smartwatch here. Now this is the third iteration of the watch, and I just wanted to kind of get a hold of it because first of all, I got a huge discount on it. Uh, it was only about twenty dollars, not including taxes. After uh, right now, it is selling for thirty nine ninety nine on Amazon. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the link up down below. I did have a discount code, so that's why I got it so cheap. Uh, but again, guys. Again, this is the Umidigi U-Watch 3 fitness tracker, and I really wanted to check this out because they've been they've been kind of putting a bunch of these watches out uh, over the last year, year and a half, and for the most part, you know, I really wasn't interested because I've had smart, like, I guess cheap generic or whatever you want to call them, smart watches, and I'm actually uh, sporting the Apple iWatch right now. So here's my Apple iWatch. Um, can't really see it too much because my autofocus is horrible on this, but let's get this open. I've noticed a trend with these boxes on the Umidigis though is that they all have they, they all come with a black box so so here's the watch itself and I ordered the one with the red band just because I thought that one looks pretty cool so let me see if I have to pull this out or if it's this just comes out I think this just comes out so or the whole thing comes out let's see Ooh, okay all right so let's let's pull it out you can see here that I kind of have to undo the band I think in order to to get things out oh not really you just have to pull this out I want to assume this is going to be a charging cable and there is the instructions on the inside so nothing too fancy let's go ahead and pop this out and let's bust out the instructions <laughs> pretty thick user manual to be honest that's crazy okay so I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to actually go through all that and on the inside, of course, it says, thanks for choosing Umidigi. Please leave us a review and feedback if you like and appreciate our, our uh, devices. So I'm going to do that. Maybe, maybe not. All right, so here's the watch itself. And for the most part, uh, I'll give you guys just the first impressions. It's really, really light. Obviously, it's wearable tech. Uh, basically, mim mimics the look of an, an Apple Watch. Uh, for for those of you who are wondering, again, the Apple Watch Series 3 cost uh, $229 for the 42 millimeter, And this Umidigi A-Series watch is $39.99 on Amazon. So it says, function button is just right here on the side. Please charge to activate. Okay, hold on. You guys probably can't see that. There we go. So it says, please charge to activate this watch. So I'm going to try doing that. Let me see. Hold on. I'm, I'm going to pull this off really quick. That's just the head. So so as you can see here, definitely does not take up the entire screen real estate like the Apple Watch. So the Apple Watch basically pretty much takes up the entire real estate um, according to this. So let me see if this thing has any juice in it, first of all. I don't know if I have to press it or what. Let's find out. Maybe, maybe not. I might have to plug this in, which it's not a problem to me, but still. And let's just look around really quick on how we charge this device. Obviously, this is these are like the little sensors, right? Um, to, so maybe maybe no USB t uh, cable to go with it. Let's look at the let's look at what what came in the box here. First of all, I just almost knocked my tripod down, by the way. But this little wire has to be the little magnetic wire that plugs into the back there and I've, I've had other again i've had other smart watches by the way guys uh as far as like you know android wearable tech and for the most part a lot of them have not been very good and let's see if this one uh for again the price point uh is even you know worth worth my breath i guess so to speak so i'm gonna i'm gonna see if i can get this turned on and we'll get this going guys all right so i ended up just kind of just plugging this in just marginally and it picked up or whatever I don't know this this little connector in the back is does not work very well I or or you have to have it a specific way it just it's not just like one one size fits all but it did turn on the power it did turn on the watch it says it's Thursday it says it's midnight it's not midnight so just just going through the phases here really quick it says it's 92 percent charged so I don't even think I need that that little charger so let me let me go ahead and take off my Apple watch now let me put this right here again you guys can see here I have my Apple watch and we'll see how it goes again this is just a quick overview guys let's put this little smart band on let's see if it even fits right I feel like 
Um, some of these might not fit depending on how skinny your wrists are. My, my wrist is pretty skinny. Uh, again, I got this in a few, I got this in red just because I thought the red band looked pretty cool. So we'll see how it goes. Does it have one of those wrist movement indicators? Let's find out. There we go. It, it, I mean, it does. Uh, it doesn't pick up as fast as you would like it to, to obviously. Um, but let's let's see let's just kind of see uh what over let's let's see what we got here okay here we go let's just see on what kind of stuff it has so it does have a step tracker obviously uh the date and time which i'll have to configure once i get this set up with the watch or with the phone um and just the messaging right now so i'll probably have to configure this guys but again this is just an unboxing of the device so uh, i will try to get another video of me using the app on this uh phone obviously i'll have to check the the booklet over here just to kind of figure out what's going on there uh, and i'm going to go ahead and actually link it up with my umadigi a5 pro so for those of you wondering like if i'm going to actually connect it to the phone yes i am here's my umadigi a5 pro for proof but again guys here is the umadigi u watch series 3 Three. Again, I'm going to go ahead and leave a link in the description down below just to check that out. And again, I will up give you guys an update video a little bit later on. So again, if you guys like this video, go ahead and give me a like. If you guys like my channel, go ahead and subscribe. And as always, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.